Thanks, Chris. I, that's right. I am here at Tony's Gym. I am here with Steve Nix, who is a trainer and also the assistant manager. Some of you may have made that resolution to get in shape this month or this year, shall I say. Yesterday, the gym was full. Today, it's not too full, but that probably will change. Do you have some tips for people who this may be their first time working out and trying to get in shape? What tips do you have for them? Um, it's just a matter of, you know, having the willingness to come in here, you know, the discipline. A lot of it I see is making time. You know, you need to make time. Um, and then some days you might not feel like coming in the gym. That's probably when you're going to have your best workout. If you just show up and the rest will follow, you know, find your good dependent workout partner that will also help. And we also have an awesome team line, our trainers in our facility, if you need a little boost on getting started. Um, and we're, you know, feel free to ask any questions. We're up here uh, at the front desk. Feel free to ask. And you were saying put, a bat, put the wave of the potato chips, get your butt off the couch. And maybe not doing the same cardio machine every day does help. For the people that absolutely hate cardio, what other things can they do to burn those calories off? Oh, we have, well, we have classes as early as 5.30 a.m. to 7 p.m. that are free with the membership. Um, take advantage of those classes. Be something different. Um, instead of, you know, the same old, same old, just, just throw some in the mix. You know, it's all about change. Change it up. And then we talked yesterday. Doing cardio is great for your health, but also you have to eat healthy. We'll tell you all about the tips to eat healthy as well. But first, back to you in the studio. Thanks, God. That's right. I am live right here at Tony's Gym with Steve Nix. We were talking about your New Year's resolution. If it is to lose weight or get in shape, there's more that you need to do than just do cardio or workout. What things do other people have to do in order to lose those weight, lose the weight or tone up or whatever they need to do at the gym? Um, diet plays a really, really big part um, in the process. Um, five, eating five or six smaller portion meals uh, throughout the day. Try to stay away from the sugars, the sodas, the chips. Um, you know, try to stay with the water. You know, stay away from, from most of the uh, sugars and sweets. So put down the bag of potato chips, put away the candy, pick up a glass of water. What is probably the best thing if someone wants a snack and they have a craving, what's the best thing they can eat that wouldn't affect their diet? Um, something maybe like some, some Greek yogurt, yogurt, um, low calorie protein bar, stuff like that that you can snack on. Smoothies so. would probably be a good option as well. Right, right. Um, two of my meals consist of a protein shake, so that would be very good as well. And we were just talking about when you do make your resolution about diets, don't try to shoot for the stars and lose 40 or 50 pounds in a month. It kind of takes time to tone up and lose weight. You were talking about that a little earlier. Yes, yes. You know, like I said, um, take some perseverance. You know, set small goals and achieve them. Don't set a, you know, unrealistic goal. Just set small ones and achieve them and work on as you go. And we were talking about you can lift 40, 50 pounds a day during the entire week, but you won't see results instantly. It usually takes some time. What is an average amount of time for someone to see those results? Uh, usually about four to six weeks. I'm um, going to start seeing some results, but don't give up. You know, just keep pressing on, persevering. And the more you lose weight, the toner you get, it takes a little longer to see those results, I'm assuming. Yes, yes, but once you do, I mean, you know, like, I, it's awesome to hear stories of people who have now put down their cholesterol medication or their blood pressure medication because they've lost the weight. You know, once you start working out, it puts out happy endorphins, um, gives you, you know, good attitude. It's just positive. It gives me energy. I love it. I love it. So. Perfect. Thank you for coming on this morning. Happy New Year's to you. Happy New Year's to you. Too. Back to you, Doug, in the studio. Hopefully this helped most of you out today.